Hello everyone, and welcome back to my playthrough of Alan Wake 2. Last time, we finally made our way to Caldera Street Station, um, and we actually met up with Sheriff Tim Breaker twice, actually, who also somehow got sucked into the dark place. Um, well, I mean, we know that he got sucked. I, I gotta stop saying suck. He got taken, misplaced, displaced even, uh, into the dark place, and... Um, he's aware that Alan is there. He's met him a few times, but we are, we don't remember for some reason. Um, and we were just going through the tunnels, um, and kind of changing the scene, changing the plot based on like the different storyboards. Cause Alan's rewriting the story as he's going along, right? To kind of make it easier for him to escape. So that's... That's been a really cool mechanic. Uh, I, I really, really dig that. As much as I love, like, the detective stuff that Saga does, like, the whole putting shit up on the board, like, the clues and shit, uh, the evidence, like, this is... The, like, the, this plot mechanic is, like, even better. Like, moving the the players, the, the settings around. I really hope they go, like, balls to the wall with it. Like, I, I hope... Um, they they do more with it. Two box. Oh right. We can store shit. Um. I think I'm okay for now. The memory is fading like a dream. I must hold on to it. I remember an awful beacon in the darkness, a scene of a ritualistic murder site in the subway tunnels. Is it a previous draft of my writing? Must be. I've been trying to shape the dark place around me, but so much fades away. Even my memory of the process washed yeah. away by dark waves. But some things remain. The darkest, nastiest elements, like the murder site. It's my goal. A stepping stone to travel deeper to escape. Write a narrative that takes me there. Casey will lead me to it. Well... Case is dead. For all intents and purposes, he's, he's, he's dead. Alright, so I'm guessing we have to suck the light out of this thing. Uh, I can't. It won't let me. Oh, I gotta go through here. The train blocked my way forward. But it was here for a reason. It had a role to play. Did it though? I don't think I'm going to be getting attacked. The plot element I found would drive the story forward. So something happened here. Uh, Agent Nick, I'm looking here for the cult. Let's try the murder cult one first. The plot changed the details of the world. What the fuck was that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can I get up, please? the gasoline over the train car an iron cage that would soon become a coffin lovely okay so there's something there the fuck? I just touched something and the whole thing like moved. This is where the history of the cult gets genuinely disturbing. 
The cultists tracked down the torchbearers living in the tunnels. They locked the poor folks up in a derailed subway car, doused it in gasoline. Yeah. Charming. It turns into a bit of a ghost story after that. They say the dark smoke from the fire still roams the tunnels searching for new victims to devour. There are no happy endings in this city. If a story thread that. felt important. I could use it in one of the scenes I'd found. Okay. I will take the bullets. It nope. was locked from the other side. Okay. Did any of these areas open up? No. Okay, let's put the new story beat fit the story perfectly. The FBI agent. Let's see how this changes. So this is exactly what I was saying, like at the beginning. Um, depending on like what plot points you put in, like the setting, it changes shit around again. This is what I was exactly what I was looking for. Hello, anyone there? Dead. I mean, they're static. It's not dead, right? Oh, thought I heard. Thought I heard the footsteps. Okay. So there's nothing else here that I can see anyway. Cult of the word. Nothing else has changed, right? Does not look it. All right. So torchbearers it is. The way forward through the bowels of the burnt carcass. The subway car had become a burnt husk. I could get through it now. Oh, so this shit. Even this stuff changed here. That's really cool. I'm guessing this door is still locked yet. Okay, let's, let's get through. I was sure the plot board had the pieces I needed. Oh, God. Man, that's fucked up. Out of all the ways to go, I would think burning has got to be, like, one of the worst. Terrific, man. None of this was real. It was a Jesus. Tell me about it. Fuck. Oh, I thought that was a hole. This unlocks the other side? Yeah, that's what I thought. The oil, Derek. Deputy Mulligan tune. Deputy Mulligan tune Thornton's chatter out. He didn't think writers were particularly useful, and a huge manhunt for one stuck him as idiotic. Certainly not worth the miss opportunity. The plot board. Certainly not worth the the missed opportunity for coffee and pie. It wasn't even clear what the man had done, except run from them at the trailer park. Mulligan knew he wasn't alone. The sheriff's patience with the Fed was running out. So this is from the first game. I think all of these have pretty much been for the first game. Um, 
at the oil derrick, the wheel had become jammed into place and turned until the oil gurgled and flowed thick and flammable. The warning lights were blinking in a fast rhythm, bright and steady, powered by the battery. The Kasabian CD was playing the boombox, all distorted guitars and intense beat. High above, some piece of orbital junk or another collided with the satellite, knocking it radically off course. I just stepped outside to catch a breath of fresh air, and let me tell you, the weather is getting heavy. Nights like this make me especially glad I'm here talking to you and not home in bed. Once the weather takes a turn like this, I can't sleep at all. Oh, this is um, the old guy in the radio, the first uh, look at the first game. Board. Keep the story yeah, moving. yeah, I, I know, bro. I know, I know. So let's go down first before I change the setting again, or the plot. <clears throat> so I'm guessing something's written behind there and will reveal itself once I've changed. Does this even open? Yeah, it does. I understand what I had to do now. I knew how to write the ending to departure. There's light and there's darkness. There's guilt and there's atonement. But the scales always need to balance. Everything is a price. There's a long journey through the night back to the light. It's not a lake. It's an ocean. Okay. Let's... Let's change this shit. Let's do the missing FBI agent first. To, be at the scene, to see and understand it in order to change it. Oh, maybe I have to go back up. Well, fine then. Soon a murder called first. Changing a plot element in a scene without being there was impossible. Oh. Then maybe this one? No. Oops. This one's done. So, what scene can I change then? Talk crazy. Maybe. Oh, I see. I changed this first. I changed it here. So, maybe we'll do the FPH first. The scene here had changed. So I've been on this side. Uh, with the missing FBI agent. So I've read that one already. What is that? Light will show you the way. down, yeah. Nope, let's cover it up. So, I don't know what I need to change to. Maybe the torch bearers? Oh no, uh, not Torch Bears. Murder Cult. This thread would create something terrible in the scene, but it's what the story needed. I mean, if you say so. Damn. 
Oh. Okay then. Word of action found. So it's personal. Increases damage dealt to enemies in close proximity by 10%. Makes Alan 20% harder for enemies to detect. Decreases damage received from the darkness projectiles by 25%. Um... I guess this one. Alright. Let's keep going. That's my name. Oh, hi guys. Wow, there's a lot of you. There's like a lot, a lot of you. on the platform but oh god they can get in I think I will be going now. Moving right along. No oh boy. My path was blocked. I had to find a way through. Yeah. The lights would help me. Would they? You lost her. Uh, I guess we'll quick save. I wonder if these have any significance to anything. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll take this one. What does that say? Hunted? Initiation. So it created a pathway here? Okay. I don't know where that is, though. Oh, that was here. Okay. Vault? Is that what it says? Yeah. Can't even tell. Is that water? Okay, I obviously need to go there. Does that say Night Springs Avenue? That's funny. There. Um, 
I don't think there's a reason for me to go there. So I will not. took, but I took it. Wait. Sorry guys, I'm just feeling a little tense again. there. Fuck. Something... Wait, what? Oh, he found me. None of those guys were real. Um, oh, right there. I almost missed that. How do I get that? Where? I just don't want to get ambushed. Um, I'll check it out afterwards. Oh, there's a guy back there. Okay, I think he's fake. Fuck. Alright. So I think this area is a dead end. Maybe. Oh. You know these Oh jeez. These guys kind of remind me of the hiss from Control. I wonder if they're kind of meant to be the same thing. The Echoing Hall had a story to tell. Okay, I don't need to go that way. Nice, I'll take him. I will never say no to batteries in the dark place. Okay, so. I had a new location for the story. Uh, I'll go with the FBI agent first. Just because I know it's not really going to lead anywhere. I don't think, anyway. Uh, 
Oh. Maybe it does. Okay, there's nothing to really do. I guess just to show the the two triangles. I wonder if it's meant to be indicative of the the pyramid from Control as well. Mm. All right, let's do murder cult first. Actually, let's do torch bears first. Scene changed with the story. New shadows. You're not going to fade away. Oh, jeez. I'm sorry if I'm moving at a slower pace, guys. I'm just kind of soaking everything in. So there's more of these. scared. Whether the summoning ritual had been a bona fide supernatural event or the mass psychosis of stark raving lunatics, it didn't change the facts. The cult was messing with things no one should mess with. The ritual was a vital part of the story, the key to reaching the murder site. Awake, Alex Casey. The sudden stop. Okay. The cultists were close now. A dark presence rising from the depths. The writer, not of the last, the shadow cast. Third eye, project the night. This is your time when you're gone. Writer, the first word. Not the last in the shadow I opened. This is your time. Ritual friends will meet. Not the writer. The light shadow to write to lead will meet. Okay. This new plot beat would carry me deeper into the story. Apparently. Okay. So it summons something. We gotta go this way. Wake. Wake. Ah. Uh, I 
it scared me, sorry. Or it, it didn't scare me, it startled me. You're real. Terrifying image, man. Get right back to it. Wish I had something stronger. Oh my god, how am I missing? Oh god. Uh, you can stay there. Did I not get that? Uh, I'm just gonna check the thing real quick. The words of power, words of gun. Okay, I'll check it afterwards. I just wanted to make sure I had it. to fight. Alright. bullets. Thank you very much. I wish you gave me more bullets. Wake. What? Oh, that guy's real. Well, I say real. Alright, let's 
grab this light. Um, and I'm trapped in here. I think I need to go in here. Word of action. Nice. Well, doesn't this place look inviting? Please give me... Fuck. It's upper platform. Okay. Give me two bullets, fuck off. Oh, jeez. Nothing in here. All right. Turns out the cultists weren't the only ones using the tunnels. Hidden graffiti signs mark secret routes. I kept hearing whispers around burn barrels of an underground society of mystic outsiders with hidden knowledge. Typical New York. Wake. Is it? Oh fuck. Alright, I think I've gotten I think I've gotten all I need to. I'm running. Oh fuck. Run. Let's check out what these words of power are. So, words of gun. Roulette provides 5% chance to not consume ammo, ammo when firing the revolver. Personal space increases knockback force of Allen's shotgun by 15%. Sunny skies increase flare gun's projectile area of effect by 25%. Um, this is very enticing, especially when you put it up even more, even if it goes up by like 5%, 15%, is actually not bad. I mean, it's low, but considering it's our only method of, um, it's our only weapon for right now, anyway, you know, I'm going to go with it. Yeah, it goes up by 5%. Okay. And words of action. Uh, darkness projectiles, close proximity, sure, I'll do this one. Okay. The 
there's nothing else here, right? Uh, I will say. Oh, there's more of slots. I didn't realize that. Okay, and that's going to be it for this episode. Um, I, again, I like where this is going, especially with like the the plots where like you move around and change your shit. It's not anything big. Like it's only in like it's confined to that one area. But still, man, like I'm sure there's a lot of like easter eggs or like unlockables that are like hidden away you know what i mean um so it can seem a little daunting to like try every single thing every single time especially when enemies like are respawning and we don't have enough you know resources to take care of them all but still man it, it's it's a cool mechanic i'm really liking it but in the meantime thank you all so much for watching and i will see you in the next one take care